Hi, I am Dr. Prashant Bien. I am orthoplasty surgeon working at Narana Health City Ortho Spine and Trauma Center. So, I will be briefing you on few conditions. Uh, a vascular necrosis femoral head. This is a condition wherein the blood supply to the femoral head decreases that causes secondary necrosis of the femoral head which was very rarely seen earlier because of conditions of coagulopathy like sickle cell anemia and in patients on steroids. Of late recently means after this COVID season this case incidence has increased mainly because the COVID itself causes increased coagulopathy and many of the patients with COVID are under steroid as a treatment both would cause this avascular necrosis. So these conditions are very commonly seen in adult people nowadays and the symptoms are early stage they find it difficult to get up from a sitting position they are comfortably walking in initial stage as the time goes they find it difficult to walk also so the diagnostic test for this is mri scan which would show the avascular of the femoral head it can be an early stage or it can be in late stage that can be confirmed with the mri and in early stages if we just uh, increase the blood supply to that area by doing what is called core decompression the vascularity of that part will increase and it can become better but in late stages where there is already head collapse which is happening or cyst formation which is collapsing in those stages we don't have an alternative we have to go for hip replacement surgery so in core decompression if we precisely locate the lesion with the three tesla mri and precisely do a decompression of that and do some mechanical support in the form of bone graft or synthetic bone graft, the chance of success is far better. So these patients, once it is healed, they have to be non-weight bearing for a period of six weeks for that to heal completely. Once it is healed, they would be as good as a normal person.